I'm back. Let's go. Well, a new rate. What are we doing here? Attacking. She fled, but she'll be back tomorrow. Something's keeping her here. Bodies dried to a crisp. Signs of burns. Noon Wraith did this. Noon Wraith won't stray too far from the well. Mm. Oops, I didn't mean to do that. sure I can sell that. Cheesed it. <laughs> Damn it, I, I keep on not wanting to do that. Journal might be useful. Twenty seven three twenty twelve fifty. It's happened. Volker, Volker sent a petition of our grievances against the Lord to the court of at Vizima. Listed all the harm he's done to us. How he killed Johan, Johan for not taking off his cap quick enough. How he trampled our fields when drunk with nary a thought of repayment. How he barged in during Pieter's wedding and demanded his right of the first night. Now we finally got what we begged Melotelli for in our prayers for so long. The judge recognized our grievances and waived all our bonds and duties to the lord we can finally strike out on our own at least at last we can live as free men 12 4 12 50. the first day of our freedom hovel is not much of a village yet but to my mind it's better than the most fantastic palace volker fumed our home with hazelwood smoke to drive out evil buried a martin under the gate to make sure no thieves cross our threshold and then he gave me a bracelet loveliest i've ever seen mother said it's foolish to spend so much on a bauble when we can't when we haven't plows nor hose and that we ought return it to the merchant over my dead body i'll never take it off it'll always be there to remind me of volker of how happy we were that day 23 4 12 50. they say the lord is coming to see us that he wants to make a deal to beg us to return to the village they say he's calm since his son died that he's not as quick to anger about small slights well we'll see one way or another i've no intention to move one inch from here it's kind of hard to read those
Damn it, I keep on hitting the right trigger to run. Alright. Read the entry about noon rays. Despite what is commonly thought, peasants do not interrupt their labors at midday to get out of the sun. They do so to avoid noon rays. On particularly searing summer days, when the sun reaches its zenith, rays will at times appear, resembling sun-scorched women dressed in long white robes. These are noon rays, the spirits of young women and girls who died violent deaths right before their weddings. Driven mad with pain or anger, they wander the fields searching for their unfaithful lovers or backstabbing rivals. Though they will kill anyone who does not get out of their way in time, they are often held in this world by some object of intense emotional significance. This is why, if one ever finds a wedding ring or torn veil in the middle of a field, one should not pick it up, but instead back away as quickly as possible. Dope. Oh, that's cool. I never noticed that. At the bottom, it shows what they're vulnerable against. Moon dust, vector oil, and the Yerdin sign. I would totally be the person that picks it up anyway. <laughs> What's this? <laughs> Something's tied the Noon Wraith to this place. An object. Something she needs before she'll leave this world. A man. Stabbed with a knife. Died on the spot. Animals fed on his body. Picked his skeleton clean. More blood stains over there. But it's not his blood. Blood stains. Barely visible. Someone was dragged this way. Someone who was still alive. Palm prints in blood. Small hands. A woman's. Someone dragged her out. She was wounded. Fought for her life. No body in sight, but might still find some tracks. Under the right conditions, bloodstains can remain visible for decades. Another print by the well. Stains almost faded, but the lines taut. Something's not right. A corpse hanged by the bucket rope. Woman the journal belonged to must be. Wide pelvis, small jaw. A woman. Around 30, judging by the teeth. Left arm's missing. Need to cremate the remains. Gotta find the object that binds her to this place before I do, though. Was she wearing the bracelet from her husband? Might be why her arm fell off. Gotta jump down there. Hope I don't break my legs. <laughs>
lucky not to come up empty-handed. A bracelet with an inscription. To Claire from Volker. Bracelet must have belonged to the woman in the well. Indeed. Lovely craftsmanship, but I'll have to burn it with the body to get rid of the noon wraith for good. Better do it near the well. Swim up, man! Swim up! Thank you. This fight. Brew some wraith oil. Drink some potions. Alchemy. Oils. Uh. Um, a Renaria? I don't even know where to find that. Let's go. Sorry, I think we'll be okay. We got your bracelet. Igni. Yikes. Hey, I think it worked. <laughs> She's gone for good. Hey! Sorry, I don't have any green ones yet, so... We're just mixing and matching right now. That's, that's all we're doing. We're just mixing and matching. Mm. 
going on an adventure. I'm running people Whoa. over with my horse. Get the away, man. Job I done. did it. The well was haunted by the ghost of a woman who was killed there. I drove it away. I just hope every unburied wretch don't start haunting us. Well, that battlefield's gonna cause us a heap of trouble. If they do, you know who to contact. Meanwhile, Claire, Volker, names ring a bell? I don't know him. Though I did hear our herbalist Tamira mention a Claire once. Same one, maybe? Your reward, Master Witcher. The gold I'd hid away for Mandy's dowry. Without you, she'd never have lived to wed. Now, there's hope for it, at least. Keep the coin. At this point, doubt I'll ever marry. You keep the coin from Mandy, her wedding. Raise a toast to my health then. Thank you, Master Witcher. Those warm words, you've a good heart. But I can't let you go empty handed. Take this at least. Come on. What did he give me? Uh, ah. Amethyst. Sorry, man, I'll just rob your house. <clears throat> Some nice stuff you have in here, man. Thanks. <laughs> Close this one. We did that. Let's go to missing in action. Let's see what we got here. Always drowners, dude. Do that often? Talk to your dog? It's my brother. FR33K underscore witness just resubscribed for 35 months. Merry Chrysler. <laughs> Yo, thanks for the resub, Brian. Why did it call you FR33K? But it said witness. <laughs> Merry Chrysler to you as well, dude. Merry Chrysler to you as well. I'm going to start calling you FR33K. But thank you for the resub, man. I appreciate it. I appreciate it. How you I'd doing tonight? I'd battlefield if I were you. I did. Sea of corpses. And corpses feeding. Someone told me they're afraid of fire, so I took a torch. Tried to chase them off. Horse shite, I tell you. Would have ended up eaten alive if it weren't for Hussar here. Listen. Guessing you carry those swords for more than show. Come with me. Keep the ghouls off. Help me find Bastion, and I'll pay you well. All right, dude. Fine, I'll help you. Just been a few days since the battle. Chances we find your brother alive are slim, very slim. 
I would have thought. But I want to find his body at least. So Bastion don't rot there in the sun with the black ones. Meet you on the hill overlooking the battlefield. We'll move on together from there. Alright, bruh. Go, go. Hey, Bro, what the hell? Uh, my horse teleport. Oh shit, we gotta get out of here. Go buddy, go! Bastion, his body must be here somewhere. Among countless others. Want to examine them one by one? Could take a while. Mm -hmm. You needn't fret. The recruits from White Orchard painted a small flower on their shields so as to be able to spot each other in battle. There was just a few of them. We look for the flowers, we'll find Bastion quick. No offense, but many a soldiers dropped his shield. Especially if he was on the losing side. If we find the shield alone, Hassan will catch the scent and lead us to Bastion. Come on. The sooner we get this done, the better. So many corpses. And the war's just started.
doesn't look anything like him. Yo, that dog. You gotta calm that dog down, man. Come on, Hassar. Can you smell Bastion, boy? Uh, still that him? No. Made the sun. That him? No. Come on, Hassar. Can you smell Bastion, boy? Uh, Come on, Hassar. Can you smell Bastion, boy? Bastion was big, broad-shouldered. This one seems smaller, but maybe it's the fire did that. He found him! Hassar's caught, he's sent! Come on! Where are you going, buddy? But there is more. My lieutenant demanded we defecate on command. Ballista bolts landing all around, and all he could say was, A soldier with a full stomach will not step onto the battlefield. Now shit, that is an order. Can you believe it? The cretin. Stop! Oh, you're, oh, you're killing me. My, my ribs. Oh, it hurts to laugh. That needs a tourniquet. But first... Want to explain what's going on here? Bastion! Is he... Has this Nilfgaardian captured you? No. He saved my life. I, I got a cut to me side. And then got hit in the head. Couldn't see anything. Rosin here found me as... As he crawled across the battlefield. His legs twisted. And so we were. Blind man leading a cripple. Found this place. I'm taking you home. We need to see to these wounds. I won't leave Rosin here. I'll own he'll die. And he can't go back to his home. He's deserted. They'll hang him. And what if they find him with us? They'll hang us all, my Laisha included. No, the Blackened stays here. Bastion only made it with the Black One's help. Maybe you ought to show him Nordlings aren't as barbarous as Nilfgaardians make us out to be. Well, I could give him our pa's clothes, teach him to work the field, but that accent... <laughs> Fine, I'll take him in. Thank you, Witcher. Your reward, and the gods protect you. Thanks, bro. Meditate to get full health, dude. See what's over here. Run, Roach.
Yo, what's up again, Goofy? How you doing? Can we make bombs? Hmm. We don't have the right equipment for bombs yet. That's a nest. Show me what you got. Ghoul nest. How to just destroy it. Have the right bomb. What are you up to, Goofy? The cat, bro. Thanks. It's it's uh this really cool um content creation group called uh Ascension. <laughs> What's up, Paul? Heading to Home Depot for washer tool thingy. Nice. You fixing something or putting something together? <clears throat> what do I want to upgrade? Arrow deflection? Yo, this game's graphics are still insane. Yeah, and it's getting an... I, I don't know if you know, but it's getting an upgrade in, like, the 14th of this month. So I'm kind of prepping for the upgrade. Putting them together, a washer machine and dryer. Oh, nice, dude. Nice. Yeah, yeah, it's, it's free, too. If you own the game, it's free. It's a free upgrade. Um, and they're adding new DLC... Based off the Netflix Netflix series, um, that's free as well. So that's pretty cool. Giving people a reason to kind of come back to it. Yeah, yeah, it's it's like the it's called the next gen upgrade. I'm excited. This is my favorite game. So like having just giving me another reason to come back to it is fun. Let's go talk to Vesemir. As if I needed another reason to come back to it. Come on. But yeah, there's just so much to do in the game. That's a cliff. You want to go? Let's go. Come over here. Oh, shit. snowed a couple days ago chilly here uh yeah it's i mean it's it's not freezing cold here um but it's definitely it's, it's definitely a little chilly here too well i just got a chicken sandwich guys i just got a chicken sandwich Ooh, we got some crafting gear there. Nice. Oh my. Still, bro, it was just a prank. Still, bro, just a prank, man.
What's that? There's a question mark. Oh, that's probably... Slow now. There's probably treasure under the bridge. Let me see. Oh my, you're moving so slow, dude. What are you doing? Get up there. Oh, I guess I gotta be on the other side. Damn it! Let me in. Oh, what the heck, dude. Let me up there, man. Okay. <laughs> I was about to say, really? Nice. Alright, let's ride out. Ride out into the sunset. This makes me want to play Red Dead as well. Oh. You alright, dude? You love Red Dead 2? Yeah, Red Dead 2 is so good. It's long. Red Dead 2 is super long. You love lever action rifles? Yeah, it's super fun to play too. Every time I try to play Red Dead 2, it crashes on my PC. Um, that's unfortunate. Have you tried, um, uh, what's that called? Um, verifying the files? If you got it on Steam. Take it easy. You guys don't check out Paul. Tried lots of stuff. Yeah, that's that's unfortunate. I originally played it on the Xbox, like the Xbox One, and then yes. What is it, Wolf? I have it. I, I forget when, but I got it on sale because it was super cheap on Steam at one point. And I picked it up. And I remember I had bought, before I got it on Steam, I had bought Red Dead Online for like five bucks when it first launched online uh, on PC. So in total, I think I have like $25 invested in it on PC. Realize it's been half a year since we hunted down that fiend in Varun. Yes. Well, that was more than a fiend. What was that bastard's name? Drugan? May the soil lie light upon him. Things used to be simpler. Monsters were bad, humans good. Now, everything's all confused. Used to be exactly the same. You've just forgotten. <laughs> Do well not to point up my age. You're near a century old yourself. Got good news and bad news. Good news first. Captain of the Nilfgaardian garrison knows where Yennefer went. And the bad's that we have to kill the Griffin for him. What else could he want from two witchers? Go on. Tell me what you know. Griffin's abandoned its lair. Gotta make a lure, set a trap. And how's that going? Uh, got some information about the Griffin. Learned some things. It's a male. Had its nest in the Vulpine woods. The Nilfgaardians burned the woods down, killed its mate, smashed their eggs. Thought they'd fixed things. It's always the same. Instead of sending for a professional, they try to do it themselves, only end up making matters worse. Got the buckthorn. Ought to work like a charm. Powerful scent. More like stench. City boy. Rotting meat, manure, piss, standard smells of the countryside. <laughs> Remember Tredegor? Hunting that zoogle in the trash heap? 
You spent half the next day bathing, scrubbing yourself. How can I forget? You ever gonna stop bringing that up? <laughs> Fine. If everything's ready, say the word and we'll get to work. Time to set the trap. I'm ready. No point in waiting. Let's find a good spot to ambush it. Picked one out already. Other side of the stream. There's fields and a grove. Plenty of room and far enough so no one will get in our way. Good. Meet you there. I already know about this, dude. Thunderbolt. Alright, Pokemon now. Potions. What does Thunderbolt do? Oh, it increases attack power. Hell yeah, I want to use that, dude. What the hell? <laughs> I kind of want to sell stuff first. Hold on. Greetings. Let me have a look at your stock. That was all I could sell. That's not food. Other. This is junk. Oh, or we could dismantle. I think I'd rather dismantle, dude. In all honesty. Um, what are we? What is this? The music stopped. That was weird. Super weird. It's like ominously quiet right now. Take care. Let's go fight as a griffin. When I hear griffin, it just, I don't know if any of you guys played uh, Dragon's Dogma. That's one. That's another one. A game that I love. It's another action RPG. A stream, amber waves of grain, charming place, perfect for an ambush. I know how to choose them. So, ready? Let's start. Let's start. Wind's good. Bait's scent will spread quickly. Now all we have to do is wait. Come on, we can cower in the shade of those birches. <laughs> so tell me, once we find Yennefer, what'll you do? Got your eye on a contract? No. I'll go to Kaer Morhen. Little early to settle in for the winter. Snows are away off, Back's yes. Trying to find the pieces for them. Yeah, no problem, dude. No problem. Do what you gotta do. In the east. We're just chilling. Maybe a week's march from Kaer Morhen. If they reach the valley before snows can cover the passes... Well, we need to cover our tracks. Hide our paths. Speaking of winter and wintering, think you'll come this year? Maybe. Might bring a guest. Hear that? It's close. Let's go give it a warm welcome. Wait. Man, give me a crossbow, dude. A crossbow? I won it in a card game while you ran around. Might come in handy. How about that? Always lectured us on the evils, but you're a gambler yourself. Stop talking. Got a griffin to kill. <laughs> That's a typical do as, do as I say, not as I do. Watch out!
Damn! It's fast! You bastard. Don't let it get away. I gotta eat some bread. Chill out, bro. It was just a prank, man. Jump in! <laughs> not bad. Not bad. Though, you could stand to improve some things. For example? Upward vertical strike. It's too obvious. But more on that later. Take the Griffin's head to the Black Ones. I'll ready our horses. Meet me at the inn. Gotcha, bro. Uh, that little knife to cut its head off, dude? Alright, man. I trust Geralt. Move it. Medallion's humming. Place of power. It's gotta be. Those are nice to have too because that lets you increase your character's level and stuff. <clears throat> Without actually having to gain a level. Come on, Roach. Just keep running, dude. Just keep running.
15 bucks, little man. Really Put that lying. shit in my hand. What the hell is this? Roy! You take me for a blind man or a fool? This grain is rotten. No, I, I didn't know. So, a fool. Damn it, you never learn. Military Codex, Article 2, Section 3. For the delivery of defective goods, 15 lashes with a knout. Make it so. No, no, no! By the gods, no! <laughs> what? Guess you've dropped your good uncle act. It was no act. I extended a hand to these people. They spat on it. Could it be because it held the sword that killed their loved ones? Tcha! A moralist. And what would you do in my stead? Wouldn't ever be in your stead. Tell me why you've come. Fulfilled my end of the bargain. Your turn. Where'd Yennefer go? To Vizima. She was a day's ride from here the whole time? Under my nose? Might have said so. Yes, I might have. But you would not have killed the griffin. Tit for tat. <laughs> halt! We are not done. It's yours, this gold. I would not want you to say you were inadequately compensated. Some dialogues demand you make a quick decision. Choose your reply before time runs out. Are you here to spy or haggle? I'd like you to craft something for me. Thanks, man. Uh, let's repair our stuff first. And then we can sell these. And what, what what you got over here, man? What are you uh what are you doing over here? What you got, dude? Steel sword. Ooh. A Velen long sword. Two hundred and fifty nine? Damn, dude, I don't have nearly enough. We can we can dismantle some of the stuff. Let's dismantle some of this. Steel sword? What do we need? Iron ingot? I'm good with that, dude. So long. Nice, dude. The Emperor shall guide us straight to Lord. This way, that is what you call man. This is young. Prepare to leave White Orchard with Vesemir. Are the, is there anything else we can do here? I mean, obviously there is. I meant, is there like... 
Uh, there's not... I don't think there's, like, quest quests. Let's go! So we'll just ride. We'll head to Vesemir. We can fast travel, but what's the fun in that, you know? Maybe once we get to bigger cities and stuff. Ooh, that sun. That sun is killer, dude. Excuse me. Pardon me. Yennefer's in Vizima. Got a few friends there, so... Something wrong? Look around. Trouble brewing. Time we were on our way. Mm-hmm. I'll buy some provisions for the journey. Then we'll go. Geralt, we should stay out of it. Just this once. Just this once. What happened to the lilies? Took them down. Took them down to hang a golden sun there now. I cannot show Temerian colors. They'll come and burn the tavern down. Maybe it's true what they say. You fund of the Imperials. You Nilfgaard's whore. I'll let that pass. I know grief eats at your heart. You know shit. They hang my sister, dragged her out the cloister like a dog. Said Nilfgaard's no place for superstition. That they don't fear the wrath of the gods. And you, do you fear it? If not for Annie, your child would have choked on its navel string. You owe your son to let my sister attending to the birth. No. And you don't oh. fear the gods' wrath. You don't no. fear it, you cunt! No. Jesus Christ. Recognize this medallion? You know what it means. Back off. You all right? They say witches steal <laughs> <laughs> Meg. That's true. What'd the Emperor promise you, freaks? Your own land? Like he did the elves once? Get out, all of you. We ain't going nowhere. And neither are you. They won't back down now. I can see that. <laughs> 